So what, what pieces uh, have, have we thrown out here? Well, in fact, uh, in a sense, uh, this is the end of an era. Uh, Microsoft and the original PC rose to prom prominence based on the MS-DOS product. And even as Windows came along, Windows 3.1, Windows 95, Windows 98, underneath, uh, MS-DOS was running there. Windows simply sat on top of, of MS-DOS. Well, so today, it really is actually the, the end of the MS-DOS era. It's, it's also, we would say, the end of the Windows 95 era. That was the most important Windows milestone up to this day. And even when we did that launch, we talked about uh, that the Windows 95 era would come to an end. Let me show you a little clip from uh, the Windows 95 launch. I get interviewed a lot. People say, well, you know, isn't this a huge problem between you and Apple that you've got this Windows 95 thing? And I say, no, it's really, we're really coming together because until today, only Apple thought Windows 3.1 was a crummy operating system. And now we agree Windows 3.1 is a crummy operating system. And someday we'll say that about Windows 95, I'm afraid. <laughs> but give us two or three years uh, before we can uh, figure out why we're going to have to say that. <laughs> Well, it, it took more like six years, uh, but certainly our users uh, gave us a lot of reasons to say that Windows 95 simply isn't good enough. Well, let me uh, herald the uh, end of the, the DOS era here. Uh, I'll just simply type exit for the last time uh, in uh, MS-DOS. Excuse me, Bill? Yes, Doss? Bill, I brought you the PC. <laughs> I helped make Windows. And I'm running over 400 million PCs today. You aren't going to do this, are you, Bill? Sorry, Doss. Well, that movie wasn't called 2001 for, for nothing. <laughs>